Have you recently bought a new computer and you're running into problems transferring files from an old backup onto your new computer? Are you running into problems with permissions and ownership of files? Well, this is Paul, one of the techs here at MicroCenter, and today we're going to show you how to take ownership of files on your new system. Let's go ahead and get started. Okay, start off with you want to make sure that you're logged in as an administrator because if you're not as an administrator, you won't be able to perform this function. Click on the Start button, go to Control Panel, click on User Accounts. Right away it should pull up the account you're logged in as. I am logged in as an administrator, so we will be able to proceed with the changing of ownership for this file. For this example, we're going to use this Word document on the desktop. I want to right click, go to Properties, go to Security, click on Advanced, click on Owner. Uh, right now you can see the owner is Hots. You want to go ahead and click on edit. Now you can change it to either either one of these two uh, accounts. Uh, if if the account that you want to change it to is not listed, you want to click on other users or groups. And if you know the name of that, obviously you want to put that in. And make sure the spelling is correct. But for our purposes, we're just going to go back and change this over to administrator. All right, get a security message. Go ahead and click OK on that. Click OK to back out. Now when we go into the file, go to Properties again, Security, Advanced, Owner, you'll see that now the owner is Administrators. OK, let's go back out and that's how to change ownership of a file. If you have any other questions, come visit us at www.microcentertech.com.